Hi guys, my name is Heidel and my name is Heidel. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Heidel and today I am going to make a very weird video for me. <laughs> no, it's not weird, it's just, it gives me anxiety when people grab my phone and they look through it, so no one ever grabs my phone, like, just, if you know, if you know me, you know you can't grab my phone, like, you can't go through it, you can't see what's in it, I don't care. <laughs> But um, today I'm going to show you guys what is on my iPhone 7 Plus and you'll see the apps that I use. I won't go into detail much but yeah. <laughs> We're going to start with this page, the first page and then we'll go down the, the apps. Obviously I have the first apps that are um, used the most. So I have my calendar, photos, camera the weather and all the reminders and stuff like that and then I go into LinkedIn I have my LinkedIn app right there I'm not a big fan of LinkedIn just because it's so extra but that's it uh, the Starbucks app I use that every single day um, especially for my iced drinks like that's what I need daily Twitter, follow me on Twitter at HiroPG or HiroIPG. I don't know, I'll put it right here, but follow me on that. Um, Facebook, I have Studio, which is for like when you have a YouTube channel and you want to see statistics and like set up times for videos and stuff like that. That's a good app to have. The YouTube app for all the videos that I watch. I also have my Tumblr. And then I have my Drive, Google Drive app. Um, yeah, that's pretty straightforward. I have my photography apps, which is the ones that I use to edit and ultimately get my final results for my Instagram photos and just any other photo that I need. I have Snapseed on this, Photoshop, Aviary, Aviary? I think that's how you say it. The layout, Boomerang. DSCO, that's like a boomerang, but for like, it's like GIFs, but for like Visco. And then I have my Visco cam, which is what I use the most. Um, Facetune, and then for Photoshop Mix, that's for you to mix the photos and it looks like an effect. It's pretty cool, I use it a lot more often now. Pixlr, um, Hyperlapse, that's for like hyperlapse I don't know how to explain it it's like what is it called it's like the fast video <laughs> um, this VU VU V U E it's for like videos like small videos photos another like social media thing Lightroom I have moment Photoshop mix Musemage Musemage I'm getting all these wrongs Camcorder is like an old school 90s look camera recording thing. Um, and then Fuse is like another pretty cool app that I don't think a lot of people know about. Um, like you can look at move the phone like this and it'll move with the thing. It's pretty cool. It's like 3D type of thing. Um, but yeah, so that's, that's my photography things have Tidal, which is a music streaming service. If you don't know about Tidal, I don't know what rock you're under. But it's pretty cool. It has exclusives for like the artists you love, and then the setup, the whole um, setup of the app looks pretty freaking amazing compared to Apple Music, in my opinion. Um, you can go to Explore and you'll find all, this, all these things like playlists, genres it's similar to um Spotify <laughs> but I think it's better that's just my opinion if you have your opinion you can keep it thanks and then the next thing I have um, more of the basic ones FaceTime the extras I have like emojis and all the keyboard apps on this little extras thing um, Messenger, Facebook Messenger, which I don't really use, but, you know, Calculator, Venmo, 
Venmo is pretty cool too, it's where you can like send money to your friends or they pay for your whatever and like, you know, you can split stuff like that. Um, Skype, you guys know what Skype is and then have T-Mobile Tuesdays, the home app, Yelp, which is used very, very um, frequently. Um, I have Lyft and then I also have Airbnb, Pokemon Go. I haven't played Pokemon Go in like when did it come out? Since like February, and then I stopped playing it. Like, I wish you were real so I can actually catch you, but this is just like too much to go out and like look for you. Musically, I don't use that yet, but recently I went to this party with little kids, and the little kids were teaching me, and it was pretty embarrassing because they were all like, Yeah, you do this and this and this and that, whatever. Um, Chase app and Netflix are pretty straightforward. Adidas confirmed is for when like there's a new shoe coming out that you want to find. Sorry, that you want to find and you can look for a store that's gonna have it and then you can like what's it called? And you can put it on hold and you can pick it up and pay or whatever you know. Strong is an app for you to like kind of record your workouts or your exercises for whatever day you do. You can put what what you did, what muscle group, what area of the body you did and it'll like kind of tell you how many calories and stuff like that um, it's pretty good Workout is also another app that I use a lot it's, um, it tells you exercises so you have this person right here um, and then you can look, it'll tell you all the muscle groups that they have you can flip it and it'll tell you the back as well and say I want to work on my lats and it'll tell you all these exercises you can do for your lats it's pretty cool it'll show you a little video as well and then I have headspace headspace is for meditating if you have never meditated I highly recommend it I think it is very important for you to just let go of um, extra stress that you don't need it's it works let me tell you if you really like put your mind into it it really works and it clears up your mind it's trust me and then i have detox me detox me is also another app for like health and stuff it gives you different categories and it like gives you advice and stuff on what you should look for and and what's good for you to eat and what's um bad for you and stuff like that you can also look up like scan stuff you know what I mean you can scan stuff and it'll tell you like the product like what the product is ingredients and stuff like that um, I have Cloaky I think it's called it's this puzzle app sorry it's like gonna cover me but yeah it's this puzzle app and it's it has like really soft music and it's really good for relaxing if I don't have time to meditate I usually do this it is not time so it doesn't like stress you out and you just kind of go through it and you solve the puzzle and then you go on to the next one it's really good I like it a lot um, podcast that's also pretty straightforward flip bar this is a pretty cool <laughs> a pretty cool um, app that I just found so what you do is you point it at stuff what do you do? so you point it at stuff and it tells you what it is sorry you guys slipper or a shoe like it'll see it tells you what it is tripod see it's, it's pretty cool I think and then I have the camera Canon camera app which is for my camera so I can transfer photos and videos and then my last boring page, the Find iPhone, Amazon, which is very straightforward. And then the, there's another um, meditating app, which I haven't used, but I heard is really good. And another uh, personality test app. I recently took one and I wanted to see more details on it, but it doesn't have anything you can't find online. So I just suggest you go online. And for my final row at the bottom, I have my Gmail and then my Instagram, follow me on Instagram, hyro.photo, and then Snapchat, you can also find my Snapchat on my Instagram, um, and then my messages. But yeah, that is it guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that. 
Um, my apps are pretty basic and I don't have any interesting games or anything like that, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching that. <sighs> I was kind of stressed. I hope you guys can't tell that I was kind of stressed to show you guys what I have on my phone, but I mean, it doesn't matter. I don't have anything I should hide. I just don't like people asking me questions. Ugh, don't ask me why I have that or this or whatever. But yeah, let me know in the comments what apps you guys have and if you have any suggestions for like photography apps or any like new video apps and um, games or you know any type of video like that let me know in the comments below and then make sure to like this video share this video and subscribe to my channel I think you guys are awesome and I will see you guys next time goodbye <laughs> bye